You know, sometimes I think it's clobbering time, when really, it's just dinner time. He said, hey, hey. Hey. You're pretty grim, you know that. And I said, well, you'd be too, if that was your last name. You thought I was going to say big rock creature. You don't understand how hard it is to find a pair of shoes. I guess I don't need them. I could just... I could just go walking. After midnight. Out in the moonlight. Just like we used to do before I became a giant rock monster after midnight with you. I don't actually like anybody. The thing I like the most about running a newspaper is bossing people around and deciding to fire them whenever I have a tuna fish sandwich. Tuna fish specifically, because I like to promote people when I have a gefilte fish, but nobody eats gefilte fish, so no one's getting promoted. Sometimes I get very nostalgic, and the things that I miss the most in life are my legs and the Flintstones. You know, I never quite understood the mystique that surrounds marriage. Sometimes I find it a little blue. But just a little. At least, at least a body of blue. Mostly. God, she was hot. I like to go out and look for the scum on the street. And clean it up with a broom. And then I go kill bad guys. The real reason I go out and kill mobsters is because I love Italian food. And there's always a surplus when you knock down an Italian restaurant. I once tried to become a preacher and the thing that I found that I loved most about preaching was Garth Ennis. I'm the guy who goes to the movie theater and leans over and says, Excuse me, what's happening? Usually I just wait for video. Plays are a little easier to see with Radar Sense. Have you ever tried watching a play with Radar Sense? It's loud and boring. Well, everything's boring compared to fighting a ninja. The worst thing about dating Electra was she always made me sigh. The big reason I invented all these, these arms is so I could scratch parts of me I can't normally reach. I'm a very itchy guy, I have psoriasis, no one knows this. Maybe I should have invented a cure for psoriasis. I went to rehab once and broke myself of the spleen-eating habit. Spleens are friends, not food. You don't have to have any credentials to do this job. Really, I was working at the 7-Eleven when they found me. I used to spend my time watching the ho-hos. When you put a scalding, hot mask on your face, the first thought you have is, ah, I created Thor, right? I think, I think the Norse gods were mine. They said cannibalism's wrong, and I said, you haven't had bacon. I used to spend my time watching the ho-hos and the pimp-pimps. <laughs> I feel a little bad about that one.